Okay, we got like inch, inch and a half of snow and nothing really ran yesterday, but it did today a little bit and I'm happy. Again. Walking up through here I set for cats. But if you look right here, that's all fox. Uh, too small for a coyote, too small for a cat, and just not the right pattern for a raccoon or a possum. But originally set for a bobcat, right up through here, and right across the driveway, you got a nice red fox. Uh, and uh, pretty exciting. Uh, you can see he works the set right through there. He came back, and bam, got him. Not a very productive morning so far, but it sure is pretty out here. I mean, you don't get much of a view like this. Sun just coming up out of the trees. Saw otter swimming right there yesterday, but I didn't have a clear shot. As you can see, maybe there's some houses back there. But so far, I got one rat in there. Um, check the rest of these things. Don't know if y'all can see that or not, but there's a run right there, and I put a cage in there. Got a rat right there. I think it's safe to say coons were running last night. Look at this. Caught them both hands again. He sure is pretty. It's a nasty old day. And I'm halfway sick, but still got to do this. It's miserable outside, so it's got to be miserable for him, too. Uh, decent sized coon, and first one I've caught in this trap. Trapping coons is probably one of the easiest things to do. First of all, get you some of these uh, dog proofs right here. Um, they're easy to set. Anybody can set them. Uh, I use an extension cable. That way I just go around the tree. I don't have to worry about driving a stake. And then make you some bait. I'm not going to give you my formulation because it's not mine. But it's pretty easy. You can look it up and uh, find recipes. Make my own bait. Get a little bit in there and then just pour it in there leave a little bit on the outside that way it kind of lures them in and uh just set it and wait all right got tucker man with me again say say hi tucker what did we catch this morning two beavers what's that two beavers where are they at Point at him. Where's the other one? We did good. Good morning so far. What's up, guys? Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. I have a, a new annotation on YouTube. It's a little guy that's standing in the corner. It's me holding the yellowfin tuna. You click that, and it brings you right to the subscribe option. So I hope y'all do that. It helps me out. Thank you for watching, and if y'all want to know anything like a place to go catch fish, especially down here in Louisiana where I'm from, just leave it in the comments. If you want to know something and I can answer it, I'm going to answer it for y'all. So uh, stay tuned. I got a lot of cool stuff coming up. I got the new camera rolling. I had a little issue with the first day. My computer don't want to take a 64 gig card, so I lost all my footage that I had on my new camera. So all I had was my GoPro stuff because now I'm going to start editing back and forth between that. And I'm also going to get uh, the Hero 5. So going to have a lot more stuff coming out. Stay tuned.